Hello guys, so as we all know, COVID-19 outbreak has created a global health crisis that has had a deep impact on the way we perceive our world and our daily lives. As a result, um, many governments around the world have implemented strict and tougher guidelines that would include reinforcing the importance of social distancing and practicing a good health hygiene to help stop the spread of this virus. And that gave me an idea to create a simple IoT project in response to this global pandemic. Um, as part of the requirements in the uni, so we are going to create a simple um, IoT project. So this project is going to be providing us two um, objectives. One is the proximity sensing, like calculating the distance from safe and not, and also an automatic distance control where automatically puts back to a safer distance. So um, that's the idea, uh, that's the idea and the concept behind it. Um, so this is just a simple system flow. Um, again, ideally the system would work for um, a smart shopping center, for example, where there is a platform embedded with um, different sensors and these sensors will trigger whether it's a safe or it will automatically put back the customer to a safer distance. So um, this is just a simple system flow, like the customer gets into the store and the platform will automatically uh, calculate whether it's a safe distance or not. If it's yes, then the customer just can go ahead and check out the counter and leave the shopping center. And if it's not, then there's a decision maker to do um, decision making whether the customer steps back to a safe distance, then the LGB LED will remain green and if not, then it will turn red and this will trigger the um, stepper motor or the platform to put it back to a safer distance. Um, and this this is similar to my previous um, project, but this time with a Wi-Fi connectivity. So um, the modules would be input modules would be the ultrasonic and the Wi-Fi. The output would be the LCD, the RGB LED, the stepper motor, and also the, the serial monitor from our website. So I will be using the remote lab, unfortunately, because um, we don't have that. The actual unit so this would be the actual remote lab and we are looking at the proximity sensor which is right here the lcd the stepper motor and the led lights so let's get into it um i'm gonna load my code over here so while you do that i was just gonna show you quickly um, my codes sorry about that there we go so let's see if it's still loading. Um, yeah, it's, it does loading. I'm gonna show that, that um, earlier. So it's now up and running. Um, it says it's not safe distance. It's around 42 mm. So uh, the LCD tells you not safe. And the stepper motor will automatically accelerate and puts back the platform or puts back the customer to a safer distance and we got an LCD that turns red. If I'm going to uh, manipulate the distance over, like I have to step away, um, let's see what the screen says. Sorry about that. 
So it says following social distancing, that's literally 122 mm, and our LCD turns green, our stepper just stopped breaking, and it says safe distance, and you're pretty much sending out as well um, the information as it's connected to the server. So this information will be sent out and will be used for whoever doing the monitoring that could be this could be uh, beneficial to the shop management or to the system administrator so i'm going to scroll down to again to that's putting putting that in so it says not safe 42 mm sorry about the lcd that's a 41 right and the stepper goes on and it's in red so that's that's basically it and again this is just a remote lab uh, we don't actually see i mean we don't actually manipulate the sensors because they're doing that for us mechanically but uh, pretty much can do the work so thank you very much for watching and see you in the next video